Hello, James Yucky here with the Internet Marketing Training Center, and I'm going to cover setting up a blog post using uh, WordPress and how to add H1, H2, and even H3 head, uh, headings in there, which is a, a strategy to get your blog ranked with SEO value, and then just a few other tips and tricks on WordPress, adding images, uh, some SEO things, things like that. So let me get right into it. So here is my uh, blogging platform. It's called um, uh, digitalbloggers.com. And I've got a blog already written here. This is uh, one that I was getting ready to send out. But uh, So the name of the blog is going to be Top, blog, Top 10 Money-Making Blogging Strategies. And then I'm going to go here. I'm going to paste it in the top. I'm going to paste it right here as the opening. And then I'm going to highlight this, and I'm going to make this a, pull down this window here, H1 heading. Now, for some reason, if you don't see this bar right here, there's this button here called the kitchen sink. Show, hide the kitchen sink. So a lot of times when you come to this editor, all you'll see is this. And unless you know to click on here, you won't get all these other, um, you know, these uh, posts and uh, buttons here, underline, colors, things you can change. So you can go through all these and look at them yourself. Okay, so now we've created the H1 tag. Let's go back to here and I'm going to get the copy um, to right here. Controls copy. Go back to the post. Paste it in here. And then the second thing you want to do is your H2 tags. Now, what a lot of times what I'll do is that whatever the headings are to each, so if there's a couple of paragraphs or there's an opening heading, so uh, what I want to do is make this uh, like the H2. And I'm not going to do all 10 just for the sake of the video. I'm just going to do uh, the first one. But you can see it actually bring, makes the font much bigger, and you'll see how it is. So just imagine I did all, um, all 10 of them, and I will go back and do them. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a picture. So uh, I'm going to go to Upload Insert. It's going to ask me to select a file. I put these files on my desktop. One is called um, Make Money Blog. And then while it's uploading this file here, it's going to ask where you want this link URL to go. Now, I want it to go to this website right here. Just in case someone clicks on this image, I'm going to have this image go somewhere. So you basically just got to get in here, paste. Uh, you can also, through here, you can add some more um, keywords, name the file, name the image. So um, I'm just going to kind of just change this, make, if that's the keyword I want to go after, make money blog, make money blogging, I'm going to go with blogging. And then uh, if you need a caption on it, description, so you can add some more keywords to these, these as well, but just for the sake of time. Uh, so it looks like a full size is going to be okay. So we're going to insert it into the post. So it kind of fits nicely in there. And then I'm going to post this, bring it down in between 7 and 10. I'm going to add another image that I have. It's good to add at least one or two images to your, to your blog. So I'm going to go up here, upload image. Select files, and I just got to remember the name of this other image I have. Actually, I've got it down here. It's um, get paid. Oops. Hold on a second. Okay, get paid blogging. Same thing. I'm going to replace this, and then I can just uh, 
change the heading. Okay, like I said, I can add more text, and I can go back and edit this later, but I just really wanted to um, show you just kind of what I'm doing. And then the so the next factor, remember we're going to go through and do all these, uh, all the rest of these with H1, H2 tags, you know, and then you've got an image here, finish the article, and then in the bottom of it here, you always want to have a, have a signature uh, in here. So I'm going to go and um, go to one of my other blogs and just grab a signature, and it's just about uh, www.james. Hickey blog. And I'm just going to go down here and grab the signature. You also want to have a couple links in your signature as well, web links to my training center and the SG Entrepreneur page. So let's go back to this post, paste it in here. Uh, if these aren't hyperlinks, you can uh, you can just highlight them, copy, and go back up here. Go to web link. That's the website's going to go to. I think I always put HTTP in front of it. You don't have to though. And then open in a new window. So you always want to open things in a new window uh, so that way they stay on your blog in case they're not done yet. So we'll add a web link there. And then we'll do this one. Go to the link. Put a new window in AmericanTrainingCenter.net. Add link. Okay. So now they're pretty much complete. The next thing you want to do is add tags over here. So I've got some tags written for this blog already. So I'm just going to copy all these. And post the tags in here. And you, you want to put it to a category. This article is about blogging, so I'll go to my blogging category. And then uh, there's a section here for SEO on a keyword. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just publish this right now, and we'll go back and look at it later. Uh, there's an SEO plugin over here. goes to Posts. So we're looking at the post, and here it is, top many blogging strategies. So the keyword I'm going to go through here is blogging, and hit update keywords, and got 85%. You want to be try to be between like 85 and 95% if possible, and then it'll give you suggestions over here if, on what to do to try to get your keyword score up. So, uh, like I said, we'll go back to that later. Let's go back to the post. Um, this is the one I'm working on. You can see it was published a minute ago. Keywords, blogging. Uh, let's take a look at it one more time. We'll republish it. You can see the score is over here. And uh, it gives you advice what to do here. Longer content ranks better. Keyword density is, needs to be the two two to five percent it's at 0.59 start the content with your keywords or maybe blogging would be the suggestion blogging top 10 strategies uh, and then um, it says you don't have internal link to your other pages so internal link to my other pages uh, would be uh, like I have the internet marketing training center link in there so it's asking me to go in here and uh, you know, add a link to my page. So 
I'm just going to try to find a, a, a reasonable place to put it. So let's just go, uh, you know, you could just even do go like monetize your blog and then copy that and go to link. Oops, I had the links in there. <clears throat> Maybe just take it back to there. It's just an example to show you how to do it. Open a new tab. And then uh, this picture is actually a little big. So I don't know if I can uh, just shrink it down a little bit. There. It was a little overwhelming. <laughs> kind of make it the same size as the other ones. Everything kind of looks uniform. Okay, uh, so we're pretty much done with that. We've done the SEO, we've done tags, we've done keywords, we've done H1, H2. I got a few things I need to tweak and finish on it, but uh, I can do that on my own time. So let me hit update. And then we'll go view the post. And there it is, top 10 money-making blogging strategies. Um, like I said, I got a little little work to do on it um, with the sizing of some fonts. And when I add the other H2 tags, uh, go all the way along. And you can see it just reads through with some call to actions down the bottom. Maybe you need a space here. Uh, there is a way um, for H3 tags. Let me I'll show you that real quick because that's the, the final one that I mentioned on this video is you can go down to and another another strategy is to uh you know to take your keyword your your the name of your blog or the keyword you're going after and put it at the very bottom of your post too so you know we can put something like uh leave a space here and then just like hope you enjoyed this blog on and then you want to highlight it go back up to this thing here go to h3 it should have changed the size slightly make it a little bit bigger and then update And it, look, it, it brought up my keyword density a little bit more, see? <laughs> so very good. So that's a quick uh, step on this blogging. Like I said, you realize you I'd have to go in and edit it some more, but uh, you get the gist of it. You can do this to your blog, uh, add a couple pictures, um, add links, calls to action through there. So thank you so much for your time, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye.